Yo guys, how's it going? My name's Infer. We're back with some more uh, Final Fantasy Legend 3. So we saved uh, what's your name, and we also took on the boss here. Now we're trying to get out of here. fight what we see as we run through back through here but yeah our goal now is just to get out of here as fast as possible and we still have the game speed on fast just to uh, make everything a little bit less painful Still can't one-shot those guys. Ooh, ouch. Two crits in a row. That's... A little bit painful. We'll do a quick cure. We're wasting time cure and not waste time using magic too. We might as well. Attack everything. Yeah, our magic user's MP is actually below since we spent quite a bit on the boss fight. The boss fight is actually tough too. Wasn't sure what to expect from the boss for a uh, boss fight, and that's really our first one, but. I mean, we had the one in front of the palace, but I'm not really counting that one. It wasn't that tough. It really wasn't. We need stairs going up. Stairs going down doesn't really help us any, but you know. Besides the exercise and maybe the random encounter. So probably uh, one more turn after this. Oh, never mind. Since we got the crit there. I had to jump once, just because. So we need to go back to the town in the south to talk to Granny. Since we saved Laura, I think that's her name, Granny should show up in the present. And maybe we'll get something out of the present? I'm not too sure, but... Kind of how time travel games work. You do something in the past, it helps out the present or the future, and so on and so forth. So you've played uh, Chrono Trigger, you probably know a little bit about time travel RPGs. It's a prime, prime example. Not sure why you slow, it just feels faster for whatever reason. So Granny's house is at the bottom here. Don't mind the eye in the waterfall, that's kind of creepy. Ah, uh, let's heal back up too, we might as well. I'm not too sure how... Oh, I guess we are low on MP, so... Stay in the end would probably be a nice idea. Look at that money. We're, uh, rolling in the cash right now. Yay, Granny's back now. Thank you, Granny. We need to take this girl to our elder. He's on a journey. No elder in our era. Take good care of her. Of course. This is for you. We gotta dive. Yeah, short facing the water, you'll go in. Oh, cool. So, uh... Go to Curtis as well. He can float, he can dive, he can do anything he wants. So the shore of the water, facing the water, we can go under it. Let's say give it a shot. And there's a town underwater, I remember him saying. And we give water monsters too, of course.
Does it do anything besides, uh... Have us be underwater here, since float does the same thing. Can we dive again? No. So why would we want to dive if we have float? Oh, there we go. Okay. I was doing it wrong, but... TNT? Dynamite? Sorry I had to. Water thing? So now we can explore the ocean depths here and maybe uh, find some more units, maybe. They give you a lot of the exploration stuff pretty early, right? It was uh, ability to fly, now ability to dive underwater. Stuff you usually don't see in the Final Fantasy game until near the, uh, halfway point end, ending point, kind of? Very staticky here, isn't it? So yeah, you can do that to go through stuff too, kind of. Um... Kind of like a hidden passage here, kind of. And just run. Getting lazy, we're gonna run a bunch from fights. We found the ship. There's supposedly a town somewhere that's underwater too. Don't remember where though. I remember getting the rumor that said it was a town underwater. Maybe it was the present that there's a town underwater. Wait, is that an arrow? Yeah, that's an arrow. Why? Where are you pointing at? Oh, here we go. Okay. Found the town underwater. Easy magic dive? No, we're just really good swimmers. See what they have here. Fire, silver, gold, and grenade. We'll buy uh, two silvers. Yes, we'll buy some grenades for our magic users. That's totally a magic weapon, right? Totally. Confuse and paralyze. Okay. Buy two of each. Buying all the magic just because, honestly. Difference to see the intelligent tree. When it grows in ripe soil, find it somewhere. Oh, well, I know where ripe soil is at. Are we gonna get a magic seed? Ifram, hey! Okay. So we can plant that on the soil near the, uh, in the cave. Um, the dock, I guess? Soul maze world. It will stop the water from the entity. So he made the world. That's fancy. Uh, iron boots and gold fists. So, boots and fists. Uh, you're... You're one of the two. So, 
So decent upgrade, honestly. There's a three defense. We still have a lot of money too, so that's awesome. Yeah, let's check out the item shop too. There may be something there, maybe. No, nothing. Even elixirs, huh? We disease widespread in lay, I've heard. See, they just go outside the town. Ships are full of treasures. Oh, no, dive here. That's probably a good thing. And just, uh, empty land. Okay. And that's right north of, uh... Of that town, okay. So we now need to go drop the seed off... ...on the ripe soil, then we'll head back to the present. Might as well buy them real quick. Could run away, I mean, that's always the, the other option. No, don't. Don't install. Please don't. We can reverse the course fairly easy, but I'd rather not even have to mess with it. Let's be the ripe soil. We still did from seed on ripe soil. Kinda wonder what we'll get from it. Maybe a unit, maybe? Uh, we don't need a dive. I mean, it works. It accomplishes the same thing, but... Floating would be, uh, technically a little bit more effective. Pass plus X and rover to town. Weapon, cannon, rover, fast. To the present we go. We might as well explore in here too, so we actually haven't explored yet. It's like there are gonna be shops here eventually. And like an engine room. Okay, so there's not really that much here. Oh, that's the Flush X. That supposedly turns you back from a monster, so we get transformed to a monster. Just come back here and we're, uh, we'll be set. Let's take Lara to Elder. Elder, please take care of her. Lara! We saved her in the past. We must be careful with our children, too. Thanks, Elder. Oh yeah, Kronos in the lawn found something. You should go there. Thank you for helping me. I'm gonna go save the city someday. So we took her from the past to the present. Are we not messing with the, uh... Like, the timeline here or something? And I guess she was supposed to die, so she didn't really have a future. So I guess we didn't really mess with it too much? Question mark? So we need to dive again here, too, and find stuff. Ah, oh, these fights are gonna be way too easy. Hey, Ifram. What the? It's me, the Ifram tree. You can talk. I just did. Ask me something. Okay. Are there units around here? Well, Astra collecting them. Thank you. See you in the future. That's not creepy, yo. Uh, do we die first? Do we go see what Elan wants? Let's go see what Elan wants first, then we can, uh... Go dive in on the ocean sea floor. We're honestly flying through the game. It doesn't feel like we've really gone that far, but I feel like we have. Wait, the wand is here, right? I think Granny should be here too. She's alive. Let's we can talk to people to see what they say. 
Green Fountain, she's in the magic shop. Which doesn't exist still. So this will make the 16 lost magic. Chronos is in the largest house. So that's Chronos, not a lawn crap. We're in the wrong town. How many future is? Really? It's called Astra and South Tower has it. This is in Lays Bay. Okay, you guys come with me. What's that? Probably one of the four water entity monsters. Either Chaos or Maitreya, so hurry. Toss Tower Key, I copied it. Chaos dwells in the castle. So we got a key to the South Tower, then we have the uh, water monster in the bay here. I think let's go swimming, I guess. I don't know. Like we have two things to do. Uh let's fight them, I guess. Oh yeah, we got Lara, rid of Lara too. Okay, these guys are actually, uh, tough. Didn't really expect it. Thought he could make, like, multicast the magic. But I don't think he can. Oh, you missed. Seriously. We may, uh, lose here. We're gonna try to run, I think. Thank you. Okay. Get out of the water. Like, now. We're not strong enough for the water, apparently. I think our next goal is South Tower, obviously. The water, uh, wrecked us. Let's see what we have here, fighting-wise. Brigand, Evil Eye, and Mati. So three hits, use our magic users. So let's actually use some of their magic. Like, maybe we should have bought some, uh, weapons for them. Oh god, okay. Beam is scary. I think we need a cure too. Pocket cure too would be a very much appreciated uh, ability. Relatively healed right now. I think we're gonna grind here for a little bit, just get our HP up some more. 60 XP, so yeah, that's pretty, pretty nice. Next level, 109 XP. And Sharon be 123, so yeah, she's like right there too. So yeah, let's grind at least at one level out, maybe two levels even. Like, I hate grinding, but... I feel like we may need it a little bit. You can see if that water town's still there. If so, maybe we can buy some new weapons, maybe? Or new magic, or new something? I guess it's kind of like identifying their weakness with the magic, too, since he their weakness with the magic is really, uh, really, really good.
Right, let's cure up a little bit before the next fight. Let's gain the level, then we're gonna go out back out to the ocean and try to find that town. I think I remember where it's at, so we're uh I hope my memory is uh pretty good. So right now it feels like our uh our defense is not high enough here. Oh, she's double confused. She's uh, so confused, she's uh, acting normal. Ow, she attacked us. That's uh, very painful. Let's get the kill. Yeah, these fights are not simple anymore. That's uh. A good thing, but also going to be a bad thing, since non-simple fights means we're going to deal with uh, a lot more variety of abilities and attacks and all that. So we get the future ability, we can actually go in the future and start messing around there, which will be interesting. Okay, everybody getting low. That's actually amazing. How far away is our next level? That's the real question. 515. And 529. That's a decent amount of fights. Well, we're gonna get another fight here. For what it's worth. I think arrow does more damage to the rats. Let's try the double arrow on them, see what happens. I mean, we still got one kill, so I'll take it. Okay, now we're faster. Oh, we're all blinded now too, that, that sucks. If we blind doesn't affect magic, I think it'll affect melee and we'll miss like everything, but basically. You're paralyzed and blind. That's a kind of a horrible combo. Let's try fire and ice on him. I mean, 60 XP is pretty, uh, pretty sweet. Another fight. I'm just trying to get out here now, honestly. Let's try fire and ice on the rat, see if we can find a weakness. Oh, we did venom instead of, uh, fire. Spread our attacks and oh, he's strong against fire. Okay, that's. I'll try to remember that. No guarantee, but. What's our HP look like, too? I know we're probably a bit beat up here. Yeah, a little bit. Ah, the misses. They're coming pretty hard here. Pretty fast and furious. Oh, stoned. That's... That sucks. Eighty XP, okay, I mean... Does he stay stoned the whole time? Wow, okay. We really need to buy some anti-stone items, huh? Um, stone cures. Oh, we have one soft, okay, so we can. You know, run? As we drag the statue with us. <laughs> I can just see that. 
Everybody takes off, and one guy's like, oh, hang on, let me uh, carry this heavy, heavy sashu here with us. Uh, let's make that save, guys. We'll stop here. Good time to stop. Next time, we'll, uh, maybe try to explore the ocean super, super quickly. Try to find the town. We'll buy some, uh, anti-stone stuff, too, as well. Some more softs. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please, uh... Tell me how much you enjoyed it in the comments. Also, like and subscribe. It helps me out quite a bit, guys. I shall see y'all next time, so uh, take care. See you guys.